unparalleled convenience. Now, as a native of Vancouver, and I know that this can be said for most North American metropolitan centers, I can't even express to you how many times I would circle the block hunting for that one parking space. Meanwhile, your appointment is looming closer and closer. Finally, you find a parking spot, only to discover you have no change. Now, I used to literally wish that I could shrink down my car, put it in my pocket, go into my appointment, come out, and then let my car grow big again. I think car to go is probably the closest I'm ever gonna get to that convenience. Most of you are completely aware of the stripped down mechanics of an automobile. However, I on the other hand am on a path of discovery to that end. And after learning last week about the 2011 Hyundai Sonata and its four cylinder engine, I figured now was high time that I learned more about the magic of the block. Here's Matthew St. Pierre with more. Now Matt, I love this engine. It's bright and shiny and pretty. But I'm well aware that this is not normally how engines look. When I get in my car and I put my foot on the gas pedal, I have no idea what's going on underneath the hood. But I do want to know. Okay. I'm ready. Okay, well first, you need three things to get your engine to run. Air, fuel, and spark. Pressing the gas pedal, what that'll do, it will open up your throttle plate. Okay. Okay? This will allow the air to circulate into the intake manifold. Okay. Which will send the air into the combustion chamber. Okay. Part one. Two, fuel. Your fuel will travel down your fuel line, go to the injectors. There's one injector per cylinder. Okay. This specific engine has direct injection, so okay. the fuel is directly injected inside the combustion chamber. Got it. Right? Once you got that mixture going, third issue, a third element is your spark. These are your spark plugs. You got four because it's a four, four cylinder. cylinder. There you go. Yes. So everything is timed to perfection. When everything is right, the mixture is correct, so the compression is right, spark goes off explosion and then you got your engine is running. This is your starter motor. Right. It needs a lot of energy. Right. This is right. This is the critical thing that'll consume a lot of electricity. If your battery is dead, it's just not got gonna it. happen. And that's how you start the engine. After that, you've got this is going up and down, yep. the crankshaft is spinning. Yep. What what else is going on? The burnt gases, if you will, come the out waste. the exhaust manifold, the waste, and then makes its way to your catalytic converter and then out the tailpipe eventually. Got it. What's this over here? This in this case a very fancy gold chain. That is your timing chain. I was talking about everything being timed to perfection. Well, this runs off your crank pulley. Okay. Okay, and it works all the way up to the head of the engine. Okay. And here you have two camshafts. These cams control your valves. Okay. See, so that's where your air comes in on that side, and this is where your exhaust gases come out on this side. Right. Actually, it happens down here. Okay. Now, what exactly is the block? I hear that term, is this whole thing the block? No, that's a, that's a good question. We've all heard small block V8. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. Okay. This is the block. Okay, okay. This, this contains the crankshaft that's down here. You have your connecting rods, the pistons, the block. On the top part I mentioned just before, the overhead cams, this is the head of the engine. Got it. In which all the valves are and where you have your spark plugs and everything. Everything works together. And somewhere at the top of the block, Mm -hmm. and at the bottom of the head, that's your, where the combustion takes place. There's a lot changing in engine technology. Yeah. So absolutely. what's going on? Well, in this case, this is uh, Hyundai's new four-cylinder engine. Okay. This engine, this 2.4-liter four-cylinder engine, actually produces 200 horsepower. So this essentially is V6 power with four-cylinder fuel economies. It's becoming more efficient, essentially, exactly. the bottom line. Exactly, that's right, yeah. Got it. 